Oh, for 29 yards. In a game, you wonder about his confidence. They will hand it off. The point is, Easton's got to make the throws as they're called when they're there. Chubb will be stuffed right at the line of scrimmage. Zach Cunningham, the SEC's leading tackler, leading the charge for the Commodores. Now his 63rd tackle on the season. Third down and seven out of the shotgun. Here's Eason. Wobbly pass, batted in the air, and that one was almost picked off. Look, Blazevich goes in motion. A little toss sweep to Chubb. Not a whole lot of... Sony Michelle now into the game. Here is Sony, a little running room out to the 25. Godwin comes back and forth in motion. He'll slide across the middle and gets a little... Easy. Slings it out to the far side. I try to get the football two more off. That pass. It's on the same page. Another strong throw to the outside. Possessions trying to run the football first and second down. Now throwing. Run it here. Here's Chubb. He'll have the first. Nice vision and patience that time. Counter that time with Jeff Blazevich sealing the edge. Play call. Early runs. Pick their hand, allow the quarterback to see what's happening. Michelle tripped up. A tackle for loss. Here's McKenzie. Boy, how about that? A little shake and bake. And against Missouri. Here goes Chubb. That one far more nuanced. What a quick toss out to Chubb. He's trying to turn the corner, just can't do it. Now Sony Michelle will get the handoff. He's coming to the right side. And he has nowhere to get. Wasn't able to maintain the block. You see the pin block there, defeated almost right away. Both Illegal linebackers motion, number running downhill. The offense. That penalty is declined. 15 for the dogs. He's in a straight drop. In the air and caught. Riley Ridley. Well, Nana's become the third leading targeted receiver. And it bounces right off of his hands and a collective. Sony Michelle bounces off a couple defenders inside the 20 down to the eight. Run lane to open up with those schemes in place. Cunningham. Arian in the game and running back. They'll give him the inside handoff and he too is tripped up. The no Vanderbilt's going to try to play with numbers. Here's Ryan White right here. He's a safety. He's just going to fill. That's the seventh defender around the line of scrimmage. We got nobody for him. Block. Nice play by the safety. But now it's third down again. Passes seven out of 11 for 106 yards. Here's Chubb. Almost broke the tackle. Couldn't quite do it. Who takes on the pulling guard this time? Isaiah Wynn on the perimeter creates a pile. And Ryan White again and runs it back. So third down, here's Easton again. Steps up with the pocket, and he is hammered at the five-yard line. The penalty, giving Georgia another crack at it. He gets this one away. It's a tight spiral. McKenzie bobbles that one, spins out of trouble, and will be dropped. Loses a couple of yards with that return. And McKenzie, watch this. He bobbles this one. That could have been trouble. He already bobbled one today. You could see him giving... His blockers, the poison call. Get away, get away. Bell checks into the game. Eason hit as he throws. That pass is caught by Wims, and he'll get it out over the 37. Pops open late. Another low snap for Eason. Good job fielding that football and able to formation. Here's Michelle. Tough run. Talked to him yesterday. But that number one is an optical illusion. That's a big, thick body. Tony Michelle trying to get a yard. He might have lost a yard. Boy, the interior. Cunningham and Ferguson coming up to make the play. Well, the issue is, is both linebackers are untouched. 
Jakari Thomas. What was a strange week. LSU at home against Southern Miss, a good Southern Miss team. So Georgia will snap it, a four-man rush. Eason wobbles it to the end zone, batted in the air and batted away. Sneak your offense back out onto the field late to take a shot into the end zone. And that's what Hail Mary defense is supposed to look like. You bat it down, get in front of the receivers. Good job, well executed by the Commodores. Sonny Michelle will start the game at tailback. He'll line up between the L's in the end zone. Gets the handoff and again runs wide right. See number 82 there, and the whole pile ends up rolling on the back of his legs. Both of them kind of hung up underneath their own end zone from a couple of weeks ago. Play action, Easton will throw. He hits Christian Payne, the fullback, and he lost the football. One of their better series that wasn't aided by penalty. Here's a good way, get it to McKenzie. Isaiah to the 45. Points, we gotta get him engaged. It's the physical presence of that interior D-line that's been the difference. Again, nowhere to go. I gotta tell you, watching the Tony Michelle now in it running back on third down. Nice catch by Wimps. Eason. Pass is caught. Inside the 20 down to the 19. Downfield passing game. Who do you like? downfield. Jim Cheney actually said, I like my tight ends a lot. I think we've got some athleticism there. Today, it just seems like there's nothing there. Let's see if there's a hole here that develops. One of his better runs of the afternoon. Here's McKenzie in motion. They will toss it to him again. Zach Cunningham. There goes Harry and he is slick. Little double play fake over the middle. Pass caught inside the four. See number two down here at the bottom of the screen. Safety comes down. He is wide open. That's six points. Oh. We talked about it early start. Michelle breaks a tackle into that play. He's right there at right guard. You'll see him. He's kind of just blown up a little bit by Nephi Lelau. It looked like he just kind of jammed his hip or hurt his back. Either way, when he was trying to regain his balance. Regardless, limped on. Harriet in the game next to Eason. They will throw it to Godwin near side. Gets a couple of blocks. He is tossed down. Andy linebacker to lead the SEC in total tackle since Hunter Pullenmeyer. And guess who made that tackle? 41. One of the things that he does so well is diagnose his plays quickly and then he gets downhill. And that time you're running a toss. Watch him right here, see him in your screen. Well, watch him, he just shoots the gap. You know, look, I'm not gonna go out there where there's potential blockers You see Tyler Catalina. I'm just gonna come underneath the wall that Georgia was establishing, trying to get Heron out there on the edge. Cunningham just went right underneath him. Here comes some pressure. Eason in trouble, and he has dropped back at the 37. Just going to shoot right here. Sony Michelle is going to work to the right side. They brought pressure from the right side as well. No one felt Ladarius Watt opportunities when they're there. First and 10, Georgia quickly to the line. Swing it near side. Here's Christian Payne. Dick Chubb. Breaks a tackle. Nice chunk plays in there. Chubb chased down and this time Ryan White's down in the box. Watch him shoot the back door. And just using that speed, Nick Chubb already having to make cuts and set offensively. Still in motion is not of the tight end. They do get the snap off. Toss it to Chubb. Flag is down. I don't think Georgia was set. So to Michelle. Piece. They've been so active in this game. They had to take on a whole lot of blocking at the second level. Eason underneath. Pass is caught shy of the first down. Right.
On third and short, Georgia goes to a play action. Isaac Nauta pushed out of bounds. 67 yards for Nauta today. There's Ridley. He's, he's to the... Eason steps up at the pocket. He's going to run for it. There's a flag down, a couple of flags down. Poblano in the middle of your screen. See, he's got Leilau locked up pretty good there. Yeah, I don't know. I'm a former time great mascots in college football. A day in the life of Bunga. Georgia, though, trying to move it down the field. You know that Rodrigo Blankenship, as a kicker, if it comes to that, has played pretty well. Eason all day to throw. On a four-man rush, we'll sling it out of bounds. Way to win that way before. There's Nauta in under two minutes to play. Eason again flushed. Slings it. Crowd wants a flag. There are none. Cunningham on the coverage of Isaac Nauta. And it's wow. fourth and 13. Crowd, crowd isn't always right, but I think they got this one right. That's number 41. That right hand. And usually it's that trade. Down at 13. Over the middle. Wide open is. Chubb with his hand on the ground, and here comes McKenzie again. Toss sweep. McKenzie. I don't know if he got it. Did Zach Cunningham, yes, it was 41 and white. Zach Cunningham, did he make another outstanding play for the Commodores? The Vandy defense says yes. And what's amazing about this play is Zach Cunningham was lined up between the guard and the center, all the way up into the line of scrimmage. tackles today none would be bigger and Georgia is short game long where was the Georgia rushing attack it ended at number 41 for Vanderbilt who was running free for most of the day credit the Vanderbilt defensive front as well keeping him clean and letting him run sideline to sideline but that last play on a 